Ooh, the Champagne. Hello everyone, Grain Vapes here, and it's time to review a juice that I got from Zamplebox. And this one, what's the name of it again? It's by Hot Vapes and it's Bellini. Yeah, disturbing. Well, weird name. Anyway, let me show you the bottle at least. So, here we go. We'll focus eventually. Big Heart Flavours, apparently. 17 milliliter, 3 milligram nicotine. Keep away from children and pets. This product, unless noted as zero milligram, contains nicotine. Okay. So, from the looks of that, it's peaches and some heart loving champagne. Okay. Bellini 8020 blend. There's ingredients, barcode, and yeah. Okay, okay then. So, let's have a look at the description online and see what it says for itself. But first, let's get back into focus at least. So, there's a hand. And mm, nothing again. Okie dokie, let's stop and start. There we go, finally fixed. With a nice glowing light above my head. Right, description. Let's have a toast to finding the perfect e juice flavour. Delectable Italian Prosecco. Uh, Prosecco? Yeah. It's topped with a sweet white peaches for a tasty cloud of vapour every time. Perfect e juice, that's a lot to claim for. So, 8020 VGPG, so. What's it smell like? Let's find out, shall we? There's peaches there. Not much else, to be honest, but nice smell of peach. So, what am I vaping this one with? My iJoy Maxo, iJoy Combo RDTA. The coils at the moment are coming up as 0 0.17 ohm, and I'm vaping this 130 watts. So, let's see what it tastes like, shall we? Um, well, okay, there's, there's not much to it. Uh, well, the smell was nice. As for the taste, there's no champagne whatsoever. Now these white peaches, I wouldn't say it's fresh fruit whatsoever. Really, this next to nothing. Um, I don't really know what to say about this one. It's not nasty. There's pretty much not much of anything, to be honest. So, a tasteless vape at best. It certainly does smell like peach though. Or well, the taste, the flavour itself. That's it. There really isn't a taste to this. It's. Let's check. No, the cotton's fine. So, unfortunately, this is pretty much just a uh, boring vape. So, yeah. So that's my review for this one. It's pretty tasteless. And I have checked this on another modern coil, by the way. Just to, you know, make sure it wasn't this going mad. Or cotton bad. But yeah, unfortunately, this juice does not really have any significant taste to it. A nice scent at best. So, Hot Vapes Bellini. Unfortunately, it still carries on to be a terrible brand, in my opinion. Because so far, any I've had from them is pretty rank. It's either chemical nastiness or now it's nothing. So, oh well, the dumbs. That'll be going into the bin. So, thank you for watching. Sorry to disappoint you with this one, especially if you've gone and got it yourself. Let me know if it tastes of anything for you, by the way. Let's hope it's a bad bottle. There's others, majority are good, hopefully. Oh well. Oh, if it's just the same as how you've had it as well. Let me know. Anyway. Here's a cloud for you. Then there's cleaning to be done and get rid of. And hope you have a wonderful day. Okay, that's it. That's pretty much this review done for. So, sorry for the disappointment again. Here's a cloud. Goodbye. Nothingness. Thank you very much for watching my review. I hope you enjoyed it. Give us a shout. Say hello. Leave us a comment. If there's any questions you need to ask, just go and ask. If you're on YouTube, and you're not fam 
Facebook page, go on it. It's facebook.com forward slash Graham Vapes. There you'll find a categorised list, all A to Z, of all the juice I've ever reviewed, so it's a lot easier to find rather than going through YouTube's list. Other than that, I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you again for watching. Here's a cloud just for you, and goodbye. Hope to see you again soon. Here we go. Bye-bye.